Women's editor Sue Sternberg and a WCKT camera crew went to the corner of North Miami Avenue and Flagler Street minutes after the bulletin. And here is what they heard. I just think it's a disgrace that something like that happened, especially in the United States. And uh, I just feel it's just taking my breath away. I just think it's the saddest thing that could have happened. We're all so shocked, we don't know what to think. We just think it's a terrible thing. What can anybody think? We don't know who did it. Whoever it is deserves the worst punishment possible. I feel very, very bad, very deeply bad. This is really something to be worried about. It. I mean, it's horrible. Uh, well, we feel very sorry, and I think every Cuban should feel like that. I think that anyone who would stoop to such a thing is nothing but trash. Shock. A horrible thing. And I think uh, everyone here takes it very, very badly. Well, uh, I was in school and I heard this and I was just very shocked about it. I couldn't believe that the president was actually dead. And uh, I feel very bad. I, just, I can't even explain how I feel about this terrible tragedy. Oh, I was completely overwhelmed and distraught over the matter. I'm very sorry about it all. Very sad. He was a good man, as far as I know, and I thought a lot of him. I'm very sad. I feel just as though it was some of my own relatives.